there, it's Katrina Sawa here, the Jumpstart Your Biz Coach with JumpstartYourMarketing.com. And um, I'm here in my new office, finally got settled into my new house, um, painted the walls, decorated, I do need a few more things um, to really make it feel like home, but um, I'm all settled in and I'm ready to go to this new chapter of my life. So if you've been following me for a while, you know what I'm talking about. If not, listen in, sit back. Um, this is your business tip of the week. And I will get back to doing these on a weekly basis now. I just didn't have it all set up and ready to go. So now it's set up in my office where I can just boop, record a video and send it off to you. So the business tip I want to share with you today is um, about thinking about what you're really promoting and selling in your business. A lot of people I know are coming and trying to market their, their really inexpensive programs, products, and services because they think that's what the market will bear right now. And frankly, it's not always working. And it's interesting. You'd think that people would want to spend less and go into your low-end uh, programs. But even my low-end programs aren't necessarily selling as well as you'd think. Um, what's really selling between my services and my peers and some of my clients, what we're finding is that the higher end programs, products, and services are selling even better. And you spend less time, you sell something that's worth a higher dollar amount, so you're really working less and you're making more. And so it makes sense, um, but you have to figure out how to do that effectively. And a lot of times that includes an interactive conversation. These days people are really leery about spending their money um, with different coaches or consultants or whatever it is your business offers, they're, they're a little bit more hesitant in spending their money these days. They want to really understand that they'll get the value and that they'll solve the problem that they have. So I would invite you to, one, well, one way to learn how to do that interactive conversation with people in order to see if they're a good fit and move them into one of your high-end programs, products, and services is by having an, an interactive conversation is how I call it because that way you can really get a feel for where somebody is, where they want to go, and if your product or service is a good fit um, and if you can really solve their problem that they're having and help them get to that next level um, regardless of what you're doing. So I would invite you to sit with me on an interactive conversation if you're not quite sure how to do these. Number one, you kind of want to model after somebody who's already doing it, right? And somebody who's successful at it um, because that way you can learn how to do it for yourself as well. So not only would that be a good idea for your business, but it might you might learn a few things. You might get some inspiration as well. Um, so I would invite you to come and sit with me on a complimentary strategy session I'm doing. I only do a couple of weeks, so um, I would I would have you, you know, go sooner rather than later to this page. It's askcat.biz, and that's a s k k a t dot b i z, and it's just a few questions you can fill out to see where you are, where you want to go, and then you know you'll see how I structure my strategy session. Um, but you'll also probably get some. Um, new awareness for your own business as well. So I look forward to talking with you soon. Go to askcat.biz and we'll see you um, we'll talk to you soon.